Morning. Welcome back at 647. You look at weather and traffic on the sevens and we welcome you back with the view, beautiful view outside of our ABC 7 weather deck camera. You can see the gorgeous sunrise, the hues of orange, yellow, pink, some purples, of course, some light cloud coverage. The sun continuing to rise on a cool start to your Thursday morning. Now today, if you step outside right now, I definitely want to carry that jacket with you. It is fresh and we are still feeling the winds a little up from yesterday. So overall, a fresh start to your Thursday morning. We remain under an ABC 7 first alert for rain potential today. We are looking cool and rain chances are climbing. So very active latter half of the work week. We started off pretty mild and now yesterday we saw some changes today still seeing some changes. So as you wake up this morning again on the cooler side, we are about two degrees cooler than we were yesterday morning just 24 hours ago. And again, we're still dealing with the impacts of that cold front that pushed through yesterday on the tail end of that. So you can see Las Cruces in the upper 50s and El Paso in the low 60s as you head out this morning. So overall today we will once again see temperatures in the mid to upper 70s still on the cool side so expecting about a high of 79 in El Paso we are hanging on to some light winds to kick off your morning and then we are looking at some rain chances in our forecast now rain chances are elevated to about a 30 to 40 percent that is going to be the main weather impact out of today we've been rather dry through the month of October and certainly this year so we are continuing to uh, you know be excited for these chances for rain a lot of folks interested in some rainfall and today looking like your best potential over the next few days to see some of that rain. Now, Las Cruces today looking at a high of 78, taking you over now to our future track clouds and precipitation model. We have a couple of models and they estimate uh, a little different, but this model right now is tracking, of course, some cloud coverage, seeing the potential for some light moisture in the morning, but we are also still tracking some heavier moisture into your mid afternoon and evening hours. So you can see about 1 p.m. This model is indicating we could see some moisture through Thornillo area, but onwards from 3 to you can see about 5 p.m. That's when we're looking at more widespread moisture through the area. Now, of course, this could be an aggressive model. Not everyone will see some rain. Now, when we mentioned about 30 to 40 percent chance, that means about three and four people out of 10 could see some rain. Now, winds today not expecting to be a factor, but with some storms that push through, the winds could pick up a bit. Now, rain today is rather important because it could help settle the ground and settle the dust that we could see out of tomorrow because tomorrow we're anticipating some stronger winds. Now, with a look at your seven day forecast sponsored by Matches Firm, the first alert in effect for the rain, we are going to see rain chances slim down for tomorrow, but still present. Then looking at those winds picking up for your Friday for El Paso and Las Cruces area. Michael. Thank you, Sarah. A live look out at your 